Hi everyone, happy almost New Year's, happy almost 2019, I can't believe it's been a year already. As you can see, I love movies. It could be trashy movies, it could be Oscar movies, it could be trashy movies but very fun to watch kind of movies. I love any kind of movies, honestly. So I've been going to Dollar Tree to go on Blu-ray and DVD hunts. A lot of people don't know that Dollar Trees sell Blu-rays and DVDs and you know what? It's kind of like a thrift store. If you've been to a thrift store, if you're lucky, if you just sift through everything and go through each and every single DVD or Blu-ray, sometimes you will find some great films. Even great trashy films. Whatever is your taste. So today I'll do something new, um, at least new to my channel. I'm going to be doing a Dollar Tree DVD Blu-ray haul and the only reason why I'm doing it is because I am so happy. It's just something about going to a Dollar Tree and finding a plethora of Blu-rays. And so one day, two days ago, I've maybe traveled to um, three Dollar Trees and I found nothing, nothing that I wanted. And I was gonna give up. I was gonna give up but I was like, no, I'm gonna, I'm gonna do one more. I called them, they said, uh, yeah, we have very little DVDs, and I lost hope. But you know what, I didn't give up, I went there, and hello, there was a basket full of Blu-rays. Full of new titles that I haven't seen before. I don't know if it was just the cashier lying to me, but I, I saw a basket full of Blu-rays and DVDs and I was like holy shit it's just something about going to a Dollar Tree store and looking at a pile of new Blu-rays and DVDs it just gets my heart racing I'm gonna say that it's gonna be a pretty long video because it's over I, I think over 70 titles yeah and that's how excited I am and one store had f over 50 titles for me to pick out so that's Today I traveled to a few Dollar Trees and picked up a few DVDs and Blu-rays and I'm going to combine every single one that I've gotten over the past few days. You guys, if you haven't been there, right now is the best time because I think they're having, they're starting their new cycle. It's back. Blu-rays and DVDs are back. So they're going to have a bunch of new titles of DVDs and Blu-rays for you to pick out. So you guys, if you haven't been there yet, go to your nearest Dollar Tree or go to a few Dollar Trees, you will find some DVDs and Blu-rays. Okay, I'm gonna start, I'm gonna stop rambling and I'm gonna start doing the haul. I'm gonna start with some DVDs and I'm gonna work my way to the Blu-rays. And like I said before, I have probably over 70 titles and because I have so many DVDs to go through and show you guys, I'm not really going to be reading the descriptions and telling you what's about. I am just going to read the DVD or Blu-ray and I'm going to show you guys the cover and the case. It's an animated series. It's called Broken Saints and it came in this awesome, cool, weird packaging and I haven't seen it before but it looked awesome. Eloise. Oh. Yeah, it came with a slipcover so that's good. I like slipcovers. Eloise. I saw this on uh, Netflix, I believe it was on Netflix. If it wasn't, I think I saw it somewhere. I know I saw it somewhere. Family Man. The Extra Man. Camp X-Ray. And honestly, Kristen Stewart is actually... I, I like her as an actress, and I like her starring in indie films. Um, a lot of people know her through Twilight and they she gets she gets so much bad rap through that movie but she has been doing some very quality indie films and yeah um I like her and if you want to check out her indie films check out Camp X-Ray Lord of the Dance Live Wire Human Time Bomb What If Friday Night Lights, Glee, the Christmas episode, The Adventures of Mickey Matson, 
and I'm just gonna tell you this right now. The only reason why I got this DVD um, is because I really like adventure movies and I really like treasure hunting. I liked the mystery of it. So I know this is the kind of like a kiddie movie or a kids kind of film, but it has to do with treasure hunting. So I'm gonna get it. Some girl. Oh, I'm not even halfway through. White wolves. Oh, the flock. It seemed like a good idea at the time. Daylight's end. What just happened? Sorry, if you hear some noises, it's because of the DVDs falling. I have like them just stacked up and it's just falling right now. I melt with you. This is actually one of my favorite movies. Um, it's a great movie. White Bird in a Blizzard. Same with, same with this movie. Melancholia. As you can see, I... My favorite types of horror movie, or... <laughs> My favorite types of movies are horror movies, and it could be any kind of horror. Basically, my main horror movie that I like is the psychological horror. And I really like artsy kind of films. And I know, I know, you may think that I'm like some pretentious art snob, but honestly, I'm really not. I don't think I'm better than anyone. Better living through chemistry? I don't know how to say this. Bun Raku. It's an action film and it's a thriller, so why not? Two Lovers. Results. Tiger House. This is another movie that I've seen on Netflix, but I got this because I like the special features and I like the whole package, so Tiger House. The Woman in Black 2, Mad About You, Take This Waltz, Trial and Error, Marilyn. I actually do hope that they sell, or the Dollar Tree sells, the Blu-ray version of Marilyn because I do like that movie and I want to get it on Blu-ray, so. The Heart Specialist. Go. How to go out on a date in Queens. The Yank... The Yankles? Or is it... Oh. The, the Yankles? Adam. My Lucky Elephant. I'm with Lucy. Waking Madison. And as you can see, I'm going a little faster because my card, my camcorder is running out, so I'm going to have to rush this. This this is the reason why I don't want to give the, the descriptions and talk too much about the movie. So, Tom and Jerry. Krippendorf's Tribe. Tempo. Escape Under Pressure. Ballistic. It's going to be a two DVD combo. The Marrying Man and Betsy's Wedding. Ultraman. It's in Japanese. I kind of grew up with this, but I watched the Chinese version. Necessary Evil Supervillains of DC Comics. The Grand. Cover. Cover. Mighty Morphin Alien Rangers. Little Loopers. Nothing like the holidays. Legit. It's a TV series. 
Experimenter is actually a pretty good movie. You should get this if you see it. Son of Batman. Snowmen. Beat. Green Lantern or Emerald Knights. Batman The Dark Knight Returns Part 2. Animated series or animated movie. And last, DVD, Justice League, Gods and Monsters. <sighs> okay, now on to Blu-ray. Also, I forgot to mention, they do have TV series as well in um, Dollar Tree. So once in a while, you'll come across like the first season or whatever season in the pile of DVDs and Blu-rays that you see in their store. Okay, time for the gold mine. Keep in mind that I'm trying to balance Blu-rays because I don't want to have them fall out. But, let's start the Blu-rays. Honeymoon in Vegas. Glee Concert. The Identical. Romancing the Stone. It's a pretty old movie, but it's a good movie. I've seen it. I've actually seen this. Close Range. And I believe that it's also called Off Piste. So if you search Off Piste, it's also called that. I, I don't know how it was translated to Close Range, but apparently that's... This is not the original title. The Hunters. It's a combo pack, two movies, The Squid and the Whale, Running with Scissors. Trans-Siberian, good movie. Year One. The Bag of Hammers. In the Name of the King. The Reluctant Fundamentalist. Crossing Over. Frost Nixon. Hercules Reborn. Killing Jesus. Walking with the Dinosaur. Walking with the Dinosaurs, the movie. Okay, ooh, it's gonna fall, okay. Fame. Easy A, good movie. Oranges, good movie. Uh, it's gonna fall. Baggage Claim. Hitchcock. The King of Comedy, good movie. Did something fall? Oh. Robocop, unrated version. Fortitude. Vanishing on 7th Street. About Last Night. Bernie, good movie. What Maisie knew. Lazarus Effect. The Lovers. Joan Rivers, a piece of work. Wrecked. Black Nativity. The Warrior's Way. Hitman Agent 47. Beyond the Lights. That would be my Blu-rays falling down. The Marine 3 Homefront. 
Glee in Concert. Memories of the Sword. Also, I would like to say that a lot of these have been, um, they're from the old cycle. So I'm happy to get those because I've seen around that people have gotten these DVDs. The Dollar Trees around my area don't have a lot that time when I went there. And I'm happy because I got a lot of the old ones along with the new cycle. So, okay, almost done. Last stack. I'm going to go through this really quickly. Mao's Last Dancer. Fargo. Oh. I got doubles of this. In the name of the king. A serious man. Enough said. The Way Way Back. I love this movie. I got this on DVD and I'm so happy that I finally own the Blu-ray version. Lola versus Sex Love. Lola versus Sex Love Lola the World. I'm actually interested in seeing that movie. Welcome to the Punch. Drumline, good movie. Missing in Action, The Beginning, two. Mall Cop. Don John. Tekken 2, yes. Black or White, The Power of Few, Dolan's Cadillac, Paris, Jetemi, Hearts War. And that is all for my Dollar Tree Blu ray DVD haul. I'm so happy that I I didn't give up on the last door because it was that moment when I decided to go to the last door when I was about to give up just searching my Dollar Tree stores after finding nothing and nothing and nothing and nothing in all the stores. I almost gave up and the last door, I found all these Blu-rays and I got excited again. So. This is an important lesson. Never give up. Okay, I'm surprised that not many people know about the Blu-ray DVD section in dollar stores because, I don't know, every time I go to a dollar store and I look at the Blu-ray DVD section, there's always people who come up next to me and I'm like, I didn't know they have DVDs and Blu-rays here. What? And yeah, and you know what? Now you know! Every single time I go to Dollar Tree and I tell my family that I go to multiple Dollar Tree stores, they think I'm crazy. And you know what? I, I, I think I am. Yeah, let me know what you guys found if you've been to your Dollar Tree stores. Let me know what you found, what your DVDs and Blu-rays that you found. Let me know which titles that you want and still need to find. For me, I still need to find The Amazing Spider-Man 2 3D and The Diary of a Wimpy Kid. Those are the only two, I think so. Actually, no, I have a few other titles that I still want to find in the Dollar Tree, but the, the ones that I can name on top of my head were those two. If you like this video and you want to see more content, maybe more hauls, like and subscribe to my channel. Um, for my next video, I will be doing a, um, because it's the New Year's, almost New Year's, I will be doing the top movies of 2018, and that includes top great movies, um, top good movies, top worst slash disappointing movies, top hidden gems. I'm excited because I really want to talk about them. Um, and I want to get your guys' thoughts and feedback and opinions. Yes, they are my opinions. Whatever movies I liked and disliked, they are opinions and you might have the different taste. So, and I welcome them. Thank you very much and I'll see you guys later.